first half and the second half? What were some of the differences that led to La Tech taking the game over? Uh, turnovers, you know, we started the first half off with two big turnovers, you know, it gave them a lot of momentum. Uh, put them down four, and you know, when you get a lot of momentum, the the rim just gets bigger, and that's what it looked like. And the, their transition, especially the second half, seemed like every time y'all turned it over, they took advantage, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, they ran the floor, and you know, most of us didn't really get back, and they took advantage of that, like you said. You guys shut out Bracy the first half, the second half, you got going, but how, how important was that for them to when he started scoring a little bit? Uh, I mean, that's big for them. You know, that's the best player and for them to get going like that. Uh, bring the team up. And then the team started hitting good shots. So, uh, you know, that, that really helped them a lot. I think the ball is moving enough for you all offensively today. Uh, you know, kind of stuck in some places. Some places stayed on one side the whole possession. You know, we just got to cut and get open. Pass the ball more, you know. We'll be all right. You look right now, you all are actually playing pretty well defensively. Do you feel like offense, there's just still a lot of room to grow with this team? Yeah, offense. We are good defensively, but the offense is kind of slacking right now. Well, what kind of things did you all learn about this team on this road trip home one on one? Um, you know, you can't turn the ball over a lot on the road because it's not going to you know, it's not gonna go like that. Uh, they went on a 19-2 to two run coming into the second half. and. You know, like Coach said in the locker room, you ain't gonna win games no matter if you have 30 or any of that. You let them go on 19-2 run like that, it's just not gonna be a good outcome.